There are three rules to Creative Chef. Rule number one, I cook something outlandish that's never been cooked before. Rule number two, I don't use a recipe. And rule number three, I cannot look anything up on the internet. Let's get started! All right, pickle bread. I know that pickle bread will need pickles. Bread also has flour in it, and pretty sure it has salt. Everything could use some salt. And then bread. Uh, bread after that. Br um, yeast! There's yeast! Okay, yeast goes into bread. And then... Uh, shoot, okay, let's see what else. Uh, whole wheat flour, yeah, water. Okay, I can do that. Uh, Corn syrup, no, yeast, salt, isn't there eggs? Is eggs a thing in bread? Vinegar, and water, <laughs> is that all we need? Vegetable oil, probably vegetable oil, that's a thing. Alright, let's do this. Step number one is the yeast. Uh, okay, what do we do? Oh, that doesn't even say how to use it. I think you mix it with water. Hot water. Let's do it! Alright, so we're gonna heat up some water for our yeast. Uh... There's not that much water in bread, right? Uh, let's just do that much. Great, next we need some little bit of pickle juice in there, just uh... When do we need that yet? Yeah, let's get that, right now, why not? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's getting everywhere. Yeah, that looks about right. Right? Mmm. A nice, delicious color there to start off our bread with. Perfect. Just what we want. Okay, and as we wait for the water to heat up, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get some pickles going in our blender. Um, because we need pickles, obviously, in the bread. And what better way to have pickles in bread than to just blend them up and stick them in there later. These are really good pickles, actually. Normally the highest quality for pickle bread. Okay! And then we choose, uh... Whip? That's whip? No, it's puree, these pickles. Mm, yeah! Okay, next we're going to, uh... Get our yeast going. In our water-pickle juice combo. I'm really worried this bread's just gonna be super wet. So much liquid and pickles. This might be, ultimately, way too much yeast. But, uh, I don't know how yeast works, so why not? Awesome. Dissolve that stuff up. And wait ten minutes. Alright, time to get in action. We've got our yeast, water, pickle juice mixture. We're gonna put that in our bowl. la di da Great. Then... Uh, just for kicks, we're gonna add some oil, because I think that's a good thing. Uh, just sort of, nah, nah. Yeah, like that much. Looks good. Great. Our next step is a little bit of salt. Uh, probably a lot of salt. Okay, perfect. Next, we're gonna work on our picture pickle combo. Mmm, get that in there. Oh, well, it's kinda stuck. Okay, yep, that's that's gonna be good enough. Let's leave the rest for later. Lastly, obviously our most important part of any bread is flour. We're just gonna pour maybe all of this in here, we'll see. I also have a feeling that you aren't supposed to pour in all the flour at the same time, but that's probably not true, right? This spoon looks great. And let's get to mixing. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna need some more flour. I guess this all knows, we all know what that means. Let's go. Thank <laughs> you. 
More flour. And everything smells like pickles in here. Which isn't super pleasant. Mmm, yeah, we need a lot more, I think. Oh gosh, this is my counter. Okay. It's gonna need this this bread here. Wait, when do I let it rise? Isn't that a thing? Do I do that now? I put it in a bowl and cover it and let it rise? When? Shoot, I don't know. I can just bake it, I guess. It's got yeast in it. It's gonna do something. Alright, let's preheat the oven. I probably should have done this earlier. The oven tells me 350. I trust the oven. Let's do it. 350 it is, oven. Hope you're right. I start off slow. We'll get there. Okay, and then we get our bread, and we want this in a nice bread shape. Um, which, how do I do that? Uh, bread shape. I don't want it. That looks like a, like a loaf of bread, kinda enough. Okay, that's ready for the oven when, as soon as it warms up. What are we at? Still at 100, okay, we're gonna get there. That's gonna be our pickle bread right there. Yep, got it. I had a little pickle relish topping. All right, so we've melted a little bit of butter, it's gonna Put that on top, because that's the thing, I think, maybe, it's kind of, yeah, just get that, get that places. Great. Perfect. Ready for the oven. Alright, let's get this guy in the oven. Cook away, my pickle bread. And, uh, timer, uh, no, oh, 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 that's not the timer. Alright, this is the current update on our pickle bread. Um, I think it could cook longer. Oh, that looks great. Yep, why not? Okay, let's see how it's doing. That... That could be done. Maybe. No, that's not done yet. That's not bread. That's that's still goop down in there. Here it is, our pickle bread. <laughs> that seems kind of bread-like. Okay, it's time for the grand reveal. Here I have my, my slice of pickle bread, at least theoretically. It's pickle. Okay, so you can see the pickles in it.
podcast. Well, it doesn't taste bad. It's not revolting. It's just extremely unique. I'm on a scale of 1 to 10 on deliciousness. I would put this at a 1. Point 0.2.